Well, Green Trike and Beyond the Bell did a little shimmy shimmy, and now they're on the comfortable couch. So please join me in welcoming, first and foremost, Darren de Leon. I love your name. What's your middle name? <laughs> Jay. Jay, okay. Well, Darren Jay de Leon. You are the founder and co director of Game Time here in Tacoma. Welcome back. Thank you very much for having me back. Good to have you. And look at the sneakers. Nice touch. Um, this man next to you, who we all love and adore, and we just can't wait to give a bad time to, Bernie <laughs> Rhodes, you are the Associate Director of Youth Learning for Green Trike, who, if somebody loves to play, Green Trike is the answer. Welcome back, my Thank friend. Thank you for having me. And this beautiful woman rounding out the end of the comfy couch, Jessica Grossman, you are the Education Assistant for Tacoma Arts Live. Welcome back. Thank you. Good to have you. So, Bernie, as I was saying during the break, I, I ran into some friends in a local shop here in Tacoma. They were talking about putting together an after-school program, and I went, Beyond the Bell, Bernie. Club B, an after-school program. So, you, you've had success. Everybody's talking about it. So, then the next question is, what's new? Great question. Yeah. Um, so we're here. Uh, this is our, <laughs> we've been doing this for several years now. And the, the really exciting part, the really new part, we're continuing with great partnerships. Yeah, It's a partnership with Metro Parks Tacoma, the yeah. school district, um, Green Trike, and all of our great partners. Uh, we've got two of them here today yes. on the couch. Um, and, and really, we're going through, there's four sessions every single school year. Um, we're in the middle of our third session right now, and registration for the fourth and final school year session um, starts at the end of the month, which is oh, shocking. We were talking about it before. It's, it's almost the end of the school year. And, so. and, and that session is, is the summer session, is that it's, right? Uh, no, session four is, is the end of the school year, and okay. then we run into summer, which we, is a so whole nother even, fun. That's even better. E even we better, get another yes. session, then we get summer. I love this. Jessica, Tacoma Arts Live, um, as we just had on the comfy couch, has been a provider of after-school programs for many, many years. I'm going to say decades, mm -hmm. because I can remember seeing students in the theater of the square down there. Um, what sorts of programs do you offer? Yeah, we offer a wide variety of programs. Obviously, as an arts nonprofit, we are focused on the arts. Yes. Um, so theater, music, um, visual arts and dance. Yes. Um, so right now in our Club B and Beyond the Bell programs, we have um, ukulele, world drumming, <clears throat> we've had step, <clears throat> sorry, and my favorite program, not to be biased, is definitely <laughs> uh, Ballet Folklorico. Yes, there it is. And what does that mean? Um, Ballet Folklorico, it's um, f folkloric Mexican dance. It's an art style that is all about, you know, the traditions and the cultures of Mexico. I, lo I, lo I love it, and that just beautifully trips off your tongue. Are you going to show us some later on in this? You know, I think I have a willing participant, oh, and I good. might be able to show a, okay. few, a few steps in a <laughs> bit. Okay, so start wiggling your toes, because I'm going to say, <laughs> hit it, and you're going to get up in just a second here. So, Darren, you are a partner. You, you have faith in this trinity that you're with here on the couch. Um, why are these partnerships so important? Because partnerships are also work. And when you own your own business, it's not just, hey, let's partner. It is a whole a division you're opening up. So why is that important? Absolutely. Uh, I believe better together, right? I, I grew up playing sports. Uh, I'm a coach. Um, you know, when, you know, everyone can be great at some things, right? But That's when, right. when you bring multiple people together, especially from different uh, facets, um, to make one, it's just such a stronger impact. And then it makes our community and everyone involved feel belonging, right? Inclusivity. Yes. And then it's just fun. I love that. Jessica, um, when we talk about um, Folklorico, how do you introduce that? program um, and and how do you get people to buy in and to see the beauty of it yeah so I think a lot of people they hear folklorico ballet folklorico and they think oh it's dance but right. I always say that my program it's a cultural program right 
Folklorico is the ens essence of Mexico. It is, you know, music, it's costume, it explores different areas. And not many people realize that every state in Mexico has a different costume, has a different style of dance, has a different style of music. It's such a beautiful mix of European culture, um, indigenous mestizo culture, um, even Afro culture. There's wow. a lot of Afro beats in the southern parts of Mexico. So it's it's not just dance. Right? No. This is culture. This is legacy. And for my students who are Hispanic, it's amazing for them to explore that in a place where usually they don't see that representation. I bet. And then they get to go home and teach their parents and teach and the do. whole family. And then yes. we have, a, we have a, a revitalization of a culture, which, yes, mm -hmm. boy, that's, that's quite phenomenal. Um, Darren, when we think about what, what happens with something called Impact Night, what is that? So Impact Night is a Friday evening to where um, youth can come uh, at, at Stewart Middle School. Uh, they can be fed a hot meal, so we feed hundreds of kids meals. They can participate in sports activities. We have an art activity every night people can nice. participate in. It's a safe, positive place where kids can kind of be themselves, right? It's from 6 to 10 p.m. And uh, one of our uh, hugest uh, partners and this is Kids Mental Health Pierce County. Nice. Um, so we, they come and uh, partner with us and we, we do uh, we call Get Your Mind Right for them. So we talk about mental health, we talk about issues in school, issues at home in those situations as well. So it's just a, a night of all those things in one place. That is so impressive because, you know, I look back at my teenage years. We had a, a beautiful community center that had dances every weekend. And right. we would all, this is in the 80s, so we right. would crowd the floor <laughs> and have a great yeah. time. But now that I think about how um, young people get together, a lot of times it's over the phone, it's FaceTime, and there's something right. to be said for being in the same room and learning how to eat together, to mm -hmm. draw together, to play basketball together, and sure. especially on a Friday night. That makes memories. So speaking of making memories, Bernie, what happens in the summer when kids are out of school, first off, and then how do we get involved? Yeah, so Darren set me up really great for this question. <laughs> um, so we're gonna do our summer late nights uh, again this year. Um, okay. We're gonna do it in partnership with the same partners as last year are gonna do it this year. Excellent. Um, Metro Parks, Boys and Girls Club, YMCA, Green Trike, and all of our awesome uh, providers uh, like like uh, like Game Time and, and Tacoma Arts Live. I love that. Um, and how we can get involved, we're still planning summer. We'll have to come back and Yo, give you got you got to come back. I got to have a summer preview. Um, but if anybody is interested in becoming one of our providers, uh, maybe you can join the couch. There maybe they can join the couch with me. Yeah. Um, it, it, just reach out to uh, to Green Strike and we can we can make it happen. So before I send you off over there to dance in the cafe space, Jessica, one last question for you. Why is it important? Um, why is this program and the work you do? It's so important to Tacoma Arts Live because you have you have youth programs, you have camps, you have you register families, but what does it mean to the students? Yeah, this program and this partnership with Green Trike and all our other awesome partners, it really gives accessible programming to students. Mm -hmm. And a lot of my students are low income. They might have difficulty getting to downtown Tacoma even from yes. the east side. And um I think that really this offers them a safe space, right. quality content, and a chance to create a community. And I know a lot of my students, when they first come in, they might not be the best of friends, but they really, they yes. form a family. Well, speaking of the best of friends, three amigos, <laughs> go ahead and stand up. We have you yeah. on wireless mics. It's just the two of you. Okay. Tell us what you're doing, Jessica, and we have a minute 40. Yeah. We are going to learn two steps from a song from the state of Sinaloa. All you need to know is Sinaloa is all about, you know, party, banda music, upbeat, very fun, think carnival, right? So our first step, we're gonna have our hands on our hips and you gotta loosen up, shimmy your shoulders a little bit. You're gonna point your toe out and then you're gonna come in and then you're gonna point out and in and you're gonna point out and in. Shake and you're gonna it. Point hey. out and in, good. <laughs> and that leads into our next step. This one's a little bit more tricky. We're gonna jump to the right and then we're gonna jump to the left and then we're gonna jump twice to the right. One, two, good. Nice. And then we'll do the same thing to the left. 
left, right, twice to the left. Awesome. <laughs> so those are some steps. Do you want to put it all together real quick? Let's do it. I think do it. Good. I'll I'll try and hum the song. Ready? So we're gonna dun, da dun. Da dun 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 and we're gonna jump. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, and throw a turn in there. Get on! Let's give them a hey. round of applause. Come on back to the couch. Come on back. You you've earned a rest on the couch. That cool. was Good quite job. fun. <laughs> Jessica, job, you Jessica. are a great teacher. Good job, Thank Jessica. you. <laughs> Thank you again so much for being here. Um, and we just want to thank anybody who's touched this program because there's a lot of people. So if you did anything for this program, major thank you. And I can't wait to have you back on for our summer offerings. Yeah. Thank you so much. That wraps up another great segment of City Line. It is always a pleasure and privilege to be in your home. We've given you some great things to think about in this past hour, so please go out there and be a part of the tapestry and pay it forward. And when you come back, as always, all of us here on behalf of City Line will be waiting for you. Take care. Come on, that's my home.